What is up my alphas? It's your boy Alpha Dog back here today for another video. And today I will be showing you how to get the new exotic shotgun called the Chaperone. Well, the Chaperone is kind of a more PvP based kind of weapon. Not as much as uh I don't know. PvE. So what you're gonna wanna do for the first part is you're gonna get the quest from uh Jolly Holiday. Which you get it from her because she actually used to use the weapon. So after you obtain this quest, you're going to want to go into the crucible and you're going to want to get kills while you oh gosh. While using the last word. So while you're using the last word, you want to get kills. You don't have to get kills with the last word, but you need to get kills with it while it's equipped. Now what happens is you have this quest Currently, I'm at 92%. What you gotta do is you gotta get kills, and when you get kills, you get 1%. When you die, you lose 2%. So the main strategy to this quest is to not die. I kind of suggest staying back as much as possible, so you're not running straight into like any enemies, and you're not getting wrecked. Hi, buddy. So, that's just what I kind of see that you should do. Oh, easy, buddy. What's with all these guys? Back off! Run, 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 run! No! God dang it. Okay. Anyways, so what you want to do is kind of camp back. Not as much as what I'm doing, because I'm just going nuts. So you kind of want to camp back with your teammates to make sure you don't die, and you can get this accomplished in like one to two games. It's pretty easy. So I'll be... Alright guys, here's something for you. As I was doing the Crucible, I just kind of went off on this little streak, so I kind of like to share that with you, just to give you guys a little excitement to this video. So I hope you enjoy. See you in the next part. And we are back, and once you have finally completed the quest, what you're obviously going to do is just run to Jolly Holiday to get your next part of the quest. So we're just going to trot over here. Everyone should know where she is. She's in the hangar. Oh, I got this sweet no armor shader after those epic Crucible matches. It took me forever because I was trash at Crucible. Anyways, after you got this, you accept the quest, and now you're on part two. <sighs> Purchase a generous donation from Tex, mechanic from the Cryptarch Master, Rahul, in the Tower Plaza. So honestly, all you have to do is go back to the Cryptarch. I have no idea why. And he gotta purchase the donation. That's all you have to do. Like, I don't get this step, it's just kinda tedious. Kinda dumb. But I mean, whatever works for Bungie, I guess. So all you have to do is you gotta get enough glimmer and then you gotta come over here and buy this thing. 
which is a ton of gloomer. So, I'll see you guys on the other side once I get done farming for this glimmer. And we are back, and I have finally gained enough glimmer to buy that stupid donation. Really, you're just throwing your money away. I have a video on my channel, go check it out too if you want to see how you can gain glimmer really quickly and get that step out of the way. Well, moving on, once you give the donation to Jolly, you find this quest where you get kills with a shotgun, either by killing guardians or by killing high level minions of the darkness. Now I recommend killing like ultras or even, yeah, ultras, like really high boss level characters because they give you 6% per kill. So all you have to do is kill 17 ultras and if you go on the dark garden mission and you kill so many uh, ultras, you kill the 17 bosses, on, you kill them 17 times, you will have that done already. You have that step done and out of there. But I'm doing Crucible because I actually like Crucible, and I've got 24% in one game. And I'm just, <laughs> of course, I've got the Universal Remote and the Party Crasher going on. So I get double the shotgun. So I'd recommend that for Crucible and just going ham on people. So I'll be right back with you guys when I finally get this done. Biabies. And we are back. Finally, I have got the quest done, I've got all the kills in Crucible, and now, after you turn in that quest to Jolly, you will get the next quest. Now, what you have to do is you have to kill the Shield Brothers, both of them, with a shotgun. I don't know if it has to be equipped, because <clears throat> it's not been confirmed, I have no idea, you can try it, but I would just kill them, just to be safe. Kill them with the shotgun. Now this is a 290 rated strike, so it's going to be kind of hard, it's going to be kind of difficult. I recommend getting a fire team together. The quest is located on the Dreadnought, right up here. You select that, and you just launch it. I will get right back to you guys once I've completed this quest. Alright guys, this is me in the strike, taking on the final two bosses, the brothers. What you have to do is you have to kill them both with a shotgun, so just go in there and just wreck them. As you can see just in there, tearing that guy up with the shotgun. All you have to do is kill him, and then you get the next step. I'll see you guys in a minute.
profiles ah. Requisitions collected. Wiping men.